Save the boobies. Yo everyone, this is Shroomy and welcome to Will You Press the Button. I am joined by the Minecraft Avatar and You join my Coca-Cola. Freaking his Coca freaking cola. And Coke is we, we are gonna kinda do a little co-op here. I've never seen anything like this done before, but we're gonna try to get the first to five is the winner. So the first scenario. You gain the powers of telekinesis, able to pick up any object from a distance with your mind, but your body exerts a force outward, meaning you cannot grasp anything physically ever again, and it shuts awesome. other things away. <laughs> Hold on. I, I mean, what? You can gain telekinesis. <laughs> okay, so I get telekinesis. It's, it's, I don't know why it's, it had to elaborate what telekinesis was. Just Google that, people. Come on. Um, your body exerts a force outward. What? So you can you can get things with your mind, but everything that comes towards you, like a girlfriend or a loved one, can are going to get shoved away just automatically. A girlfriend. A girlfriend. Go over here. Boom. <laughs> it's not mine. It's someone else's. Come on. Come um, here. There's a force outward, meaning you. Can... Give me some sugar. Wait, wait, ever again. Yeah. You cannot grasp anything physically ever again, and it shoves other things. Away. Oh, so it's like, it's like a constant force field. Pretty much, yeah. Oh, that sucks. I'm going to say no. Who would want that? Uh, I would have to agree. Oh, I was going to push the button. <laughs> okay. And... Okay, we're in the majority, so... Yeah, it's good. You want to be wear clothes or anything? So, I think we both won that one. So, yeah, I guess that was good. Alright, next question. Would you that like was, that was a bad dilemma. Because who, who would pick no? There's people who are like really, really introverted who like might not ever care to like push anyone away. And if you need, if you're like by yourself, isolated with no people, you just grab things with your telekinesis. It's like wait, if you can't grab it, you can't touch anything. So could you tell me if you just go around that? Because then can you grab something with your mind and pull it into you? Oh, I didn't think. <laughs> we already pushed the button. Okay. <laughs> no, we didn't. Okay, whatever. Yeah. I did. Uh, do you want to read this one or should I? You can create your own game, and it becomes the best game ever. And wait. Who's designing that? It goes down in history. It goes down in history. Rudolph. Technically, everything's about history. Rudolph. You become greedy with money, power, and EA buys you a help. Oh. <laughs> oh, EA got wrecked there. Okay. Oh, shots fired. Right? Um, I, I'd i say about nice still make an awesome game, and I get get money from that. So when Notch did that, but he wasn't really greedy. He just got money. I, was, I would not push this, honestly. Why? I mean, what's what's the problem with it, really? You become greedy with money and power, and the EA buys you out. At that point, once you're bought out, you'll probably become more humbled by not having not having them a little, a little bit. Like you don't have the power or money anymore since your game's already gone. Over time, I continuously keep making money off of it. Whereas if EA just buys me out, it's just that static, static payout. Right. But, but you still, you still make the best game. Best game ever. Yeah, and if you sell that to someone else, doesn't that mean... Then you, like, then you make another game. <laughs> Alright, well, I will, I will not, but you will. So I'm, in your honor, I'm going to push the button. Cool. 60 people have pressed this button and 40 did not, so I have lost the point, you have gained the point. Well, I didn't lose one, but I didn't gain one. You lost it. Negative one. <laughs> uh, I guess that was good. It could have gone either way. Yeah. Wow. We were inside. I like that top comment there. Wait, I didn't even say what it said. I heard I saw the word nipple somewhere. Yeah, EA can something crusty nipples, whatever. Okay. Okay, you get to travel to any time and place. Tardis. You do not, you do not choose when you go or where you end up, and you cannot bring anything with you. I will not. Yeah. Uh, Who would click that? I don't that? want to become T Rex poop if it's all the same to you. Uh, that was a bad one. Press this button, so we didn't get a point there. That's what? You are fluent in any language of your choosing every day of your life. Wow. You forgot how to speak. You forgot how to speak your. Oh, oh sorry. You are fluent in any language of your choosing every day. Of, okay, I don't understand this though. You are fluent in any language of your choosing every day of your life. So you're fluent. Why does it just? Why does it have to say every day of your life? That doesn't make okay. But you gotta speak your, your first language for 15 hours. Okay, sorry. I had I was writing things down. So. That doesn't make sense though. This is not worded well. You are fluent in any language of your choosing every day of your life. Right. That, that, first off, that doesn't make sense. You, you're fluent every. You're oh. fluent. You don't need to know every day of your life. Okay, whatever. 
But you're forbidden. I think I it's saying is it saying like you're fluent in any language and you can choose it every day? Or is it just the one language? I think it's choosing it every day. That's I think my might be what it means. Okay, so that's okay. We've established you're choosing every day. Okay. And he is guys, punctuation is important. Let's see grandma. But <laughs> you forget how to speak your first language for fifteen hours. I don't really it could be useful. For, wait, only for 15 hours? Yeah. So yeah, push the button. Yeah, for sure. You don't have to speak it, you can still write it though. You can All still right. write and read it. We both got a point there. Alrighty. So three to two, your you're, uh, advantage. You would you would... Sorry, go ahead. <laughs> you would be allowed to go back in time, but you can never return to your previous year ever again. That's so... just not true, because if you, if you go back in time by a year, or a few minutes, then you. So is that saying like we can't go back to 2015 because it's 2016, but you can go back to like 2014 and pass that? That's what I'm saying. Like, that's so stupid. Cause it, it's, it makes no sense. You just skip a year. You got... Um, I, I know it means. Without, I think it means. I can live without the whip and the nene. I think it means that you can just it, that you go back in time and then you can't go back. You just. But this ever again? Yeah, I, I mean, this is a stupid way worded question. But what's the really the point of going back in time? I guess to relive your, like your favorite. Well, could you could, wait? Okay, here's I'm gonna bring up a flashpoint paradox thingy here. Not actually, not actually. But I'm gonna bring up oh, shut up phone. A time travel thing. Okay. Is there another version of you in that time, or are you traveling? Your, is your consciousness traveling back to that body? Like, are you, is, will, it, will it be two of you, or just? You see, game, you see, game, these are the questions that matter. Hire Sean to make your questions. I, I wouldn't because there's nothing in my past I'd really like to change. I, I, I'm happy with where I am right now, so I will not. I would not ask someone out, specifically. That's what, that's what I might do. Would you, okay, so for you, would you press this button or not? I would, it's the, the button makes no sense to me. Because would I just skip over a year? I'm not going back in time much time, like a few months probably. Well, so, it says the previous year, so I'm guessing the one before this, which was 2015. I will not. It's just it's, just, it's not worded well, so I will not. Okay. <laughs> Grammar. It's important. 60% of people have pressed this button, while well, 40% did not, so we got no points for that. Okay, this is a perfect question for you, I think. I, it has a... <sighs> it's all you, baby. Ah! Well, so you just going to go right side with or here, or...? No, you, you read the question. Okay, you can have any superpower you want, but you only live 25 years. Does that mean from here 25 more years, or live to 25? You only live 25 years. So you can die for one year, and then come back the next, and you'll be solid. I have an idea. <laughs> I'm kidding, by the way. Any superpower you want. Okay, I want the uh, Lazarus Pit power, where you can revive yourself, or others. Yeah, that's, that's an easy loophole right there. Uh, so I'll press the button. Oh, wait, 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 hold on, wait, wait, before I say that thing. Hmm. That is a loophole you found. You, you found a solid loophole there. You all bring all the power of Bible. Well, because any power you want is so vague, any super power you want. Yeah. So yeah, press the button. That's the easy one. Yeah. I I'm gonna say I would not though. Why? My reasoning for that is. If there was any power worth it, it would be immortality, but I do not want to live forever. Neither do I. But I would say uh, I would want to have the power to live past 25 years. I know, but and if you think about it, that's the waste of a power. Because, like, you could just keep living your life anyway without that power. You know yes. That? Okay, so fine. I will say I live until I'm ready to die. <laughs> okay. That's a fair power. All right, you say, you say you'll press a button, so... Yeah. Okay. One of us is gonna win here, and it's you. Okay, yeah, I'd say like healing friends and family would be a good one. Yeah. Would... Okay, yeah, I can see. Okay, I can see how that would be. Uh, that's a good one. Cause it doesn't have to be just be you. You can, you can make everyone around you who want to go to live forever, live forever. True that. You'll smell a present aroma for. <laughs> a present. Okay, wait, let me... I love presents. Birthday time. <laughs> You'll smell a pleasant aroma for ten seconds, but. While walking barefoot sometime within the next year, you'll accidentally step on a Lego. You won't know when or where this will happen, only that it... W what is the point of this? I mean... Okay, yeah, I smell something good for 10 seconds, and then step on a Lego. This is and a then really... people pay you 
Ever. Um, I'll go with I will not, since both of those are probably going to happen anyway. I don't understand who, what the law is. I will not. It's going to happen anyway. I'm already going to smell Pleasant, pleasant Aromas, but I don't yeah. step on Legos, so. <laughs> I don't get this question. I will. Yeah. Uh, you will not, right? Yeah, I yeah, won't. Me neither. But 56 people will. Just wear shoes. All I can say is the person who wrote this question did all the drugs before posting this. All the drugs. All. All of them. Okay, your turn, sir. Oh, goody! Nuke your laser. I will not press this button. This is whole, what, who? I will not nuke nuke North Korea or start World War Three. People, why? Can what I nuke? Can I put? Can I nuke certain certain people who lead countries in one room and then nuke that room? If this, if pressing the button gets more than not pressing the button, I lose all faith in humanity. So, are you ready for this? I will not. Yeah. Good, good. Thank good. You, humanity, my God, that was terrible. All right, sir. Well, you you won this round. You got five. I got three. Thank you. All right, thanks guys for watching. I uh, hope you enjoyed this. Uh, let me know. Uh, bleh, nothing. There's nothing to let me know. Uh, <laughs> let me know. Let me guys let me know. do it. Uh, go subscribe to the Minecraft Avatar. He does some. Why? Cool Hello, shit. phone. Okay. Uh, go subscribe to the Minecraft Avatar. He does really cool command block related content. And uh, have a good day. Thanks for watching. This is Shumi with Aang signing out. Peace.